Hi, this is Ed Koch, and I'm going to be reviewing Restrepo. It's excellent, well worth uh, your uh, going to see, uh, and it obviously will uh, be uh, compared uh, with The Hurt Locker. And so uh, this is a movie that uh, particularly uh, those interested in the Afghan war and its senselessness uh, should uh, see. I hit the bottom right of the building. As soon as I pop my head up, guess who? Nobody's gonna help you. You're in no man's land. The fear is always there, especially at night when you can't see what's coming at you. Are you gonna go back to the civilian world? I have no idea. <laughs> I still obviously haven't figured out how to deal with it inside. The only hope I have right now is that eventually I'll be able to process it differently. I'm never gonna forget it. I don't wanna not have that as a memory because that was one of the moments that makes me appreciate everything that I have. I don't understand uh, uh, President uh, Obama's increasing the number of troops instead of urging uh, uh, and uh, ordering uh, that we uh, get out this uh, year. There's nothing there uh, worth conquering. If we win, what have we won? Uh, if you say, uh, well, you got to stop uh, the uh, terrorist uh, Al-Qaeda. Al-Qaeda now has, according to the United States uh, um, intelligence officials reported in the Times, actually 300 um, uh, operatives in Pakistan and 50 in Afghanistan. Do you think that the Al-Qaeda people, if they have the creature comforts of Pakistan and its nuclear bomb, or the creature comforts uh, even greater uh, in uh, uh, Iraq when we leave, as we are scheduled to, to leave uh, next uh, year, that they're going to pour into Afghanistan to live in its caves? It's ridiculous. And in the meanwhile, uh, the casualties are mounting. Uh, we uh, started the year with um, about 1,000. And now in the month of uh, June alone, the casualties of Americans and NATO troops uh, for just this month, deaths have been over 100. Mr. President, we should get out of Afghanistan immediately. And this film might develop uh, that intensity, causing people to take to the streets. I hope so. So uh, I give this film big thumbs up and, of course, a plus.